Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have the Lipstick Addict tag for you. I saw this on Lee XL and Gracie Saunderson's channels and I thought that is a great video and I'm obsessed with lipstick so I thought I would do it as well. There are eight questions so I will get straight on with them. I'll link all the questions, no I won't. I'll write all the questions in the bottom bar so if you wanna do this tag then they'll all be down below. Question one is favourite balm or treatment and if you watch my channel you will know the answer to this already because I'm obsessed with it. Um, it's Carmex, it is any kind of Carmex, the tubes, the little pots, anything. Carmex is amazing, I love it, I love, 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 love it and I've always got so many tubes of this on the go. If you go in any of my handbags there'll be like four or five tubes of Carmex which are all half used up and I don't know why, I just lose one and then buy a new one and then find my old one and it goes on like that. <laughs> Question two is best eye-catching red. I wore it today so that you can see what it looks like on because I love this colour so much. Um, and it is the New Look, um, actually, Pure Colour Matte Liquid Lipstick, which is ridiculous because it's from New Look and I think it's about £4 or something. And it is in the shade red, <laughs> um, believe it or not. And it is just a really awesome matte liquid lipstick. It does not even move, literally. I've had it on my lips for, there's like the tiniest bit, I don't know if you can even see it on camera, but I've had this on my lips for about three hours now, I've eaten breakfast and it literally doesn't even move. It's so, 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 so good. New looks, all of them are amazing, but this red is just, there's something about it which I love. So this would be my go-to at the moment. Number three is best luxury and drugstore. Now my best luxury would be probably at the moment, it changes all the time, but my best luxury would be the um, Jeffree Star Velour Liquid Lipsticks. I have two, I only have two, um, and if you're in the UK you'll know how hard these are to get hold of. I've got Celebrity Skin and I've got Androgyny. Um, the thing I love about these is it seems like on every skin tone these look different, and they look different to me than they look on all the swatches, and then on some people they look different again, and I just love them, I think they're really versatile, they are so long wearing, they're amazing, I love them. These are my favourite high end lipsticks at the minute. For drugstore, at the moment I've actually been loving the Essence um, lipsticks. These are the Velvet Stick Matte Lip Colours by Essence. This one is in the shade Peony Star, it's just a beautiful nude shade. Um, this is so long wearing for a cheap lipstick, I think it was about £1.50 or something. Highly recommend Essence. Their lip liners as well are brilliant. Um, for a drugstore brand, these exceed all expectations. I really recommend trying out Essence lip products if you haven't already. Best MAC lipstick is question four. I don't have it with me because I left it in a hotel and I'm gutted because it was my favourite and it was Cream Cup. Um, I just found it really nice nude on my skin tone. I could wear it all, all the time, like as an everyday lipstick. Um, but yeah, it just, it got left on the side, and I know where I left it as well, it's in a travel lodge, and it was on the side, and I thought I need to pick that up before I leave, and I don't know why I didn't, and I didn't, and it's still there. Damn. Number five, the most disappointing. Now this is a bit controversial because people love these. For me, it is the Bourjois Rouge Edition Velvet uh, Matte Finish, I don't even know what these are classed as. They're kind of halfway between a liquid lipstick and a... Uh, normal lipstick, they're like a mousse formula. I find them super drying, I find them not very pigmented, I just didn't get on with it. I might try it again because loads of people rave about these and I really, really don't like them. Um, but yeah, I've only got the shade Velvet, which is shade number 10. Um, I just didn't think it came out like this on me at all and it just didn't, I don't know, I just didn't get on with it for whatever reason, so that to me was really disappointing. Number six, liner, yes or no? Absolutely yes. <laughs> I can't put on a bold lip without lip liner. It ends up somehow all over my face. Not literally, I don't have it like on my eyelids or anything. But you know how you think, yeah, that's really accurate, and then you stand back from the mirror and your lips are really wonky, and it's just, I can't, I don't know why I can't do it. But if I'm gonna put on a bold lipstick, the lipstick, a lipstick bullet is way too thick to be accurate with, so I have to line my lips. Um, I think it makes your lipstick last longer as well, it keeps it in the lines, <laughs> it stops it bleeding and stuff like that, so absolutely yes, I always wear a lip liner now. Number seven is best gloss. For me this is so easy, it's pretty much the only lip gloss I wear, and it is the Soap & Glory Sexy Mother Pucker Lip Glosses. This is in the shade Charm Offensive, which is just the one I happen to have picked up. I've got about six or seven of these, and they are the tingly, like, inflating lip glosses, and they are so 
nice. I can't even tell you. These are so, 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 so good. They are sticky, but then most glosses are. Um, but they're just really nice on the lips. They're so glossy. And if you're going to wear a gloss, you might as well go all out. So these, for me, are my absolute favourites. Although, to be fair, I'm not a massive lip gloss person. If I'm going to wear one, it'll be this colour. Well, it'll be this brand. And number eight is something extra. Now, for me, to me, this means something that I want to mention, which didn't get featured in any of the other questions. So for me, this is, again, really easy. And it's probably some of my favourite lipsticks at the moment. And it is the Soap & Glory Sexy Mother Pucker Lipsticks. Obviously, I've just mentioned the lip gloss. These are the lipsticks. Um, these are both matte ones. And this is the old packaging. I think they've completely taken off this packaging. And it's gone to this kind of metallic packaging now. Um, I have the shade Super Nude, which is amazing. And I have the shade Pommy Girl, which is basically Pom Pom, what used to be Pom Pom by Soap and Glory. Obviously, because they're Soap and Glory products. Um, these are absolutely beautiful. I love them. I wear them so much. They even have a little SG on the bullet, which is just cute, isn't it? Who doesn't love that? Um, but for, for drugstore lipsticks, these are really good quality. I think they are about £9 each, so they're not really super cheap, but they're so long wearing. And I absolutely love these. So those are my questions answered, guys. There are three people I would really like to see do this. Um, the first is Ashling from Dramatic Mac. She always has bomb lip colours on, and I'd love to see her kind of favourites and stuff like that. So Ashling, um, also Kate from Kate's Beauty Station. Again, amazing, like, beauty YouTuber. I think Kate has... I have quite similar taste to Kate as well, so I'd love to see her answers to these. Um, and also... Um, Another girl I'd really like to see do it is someone who I've not watched for that long. I think she's fairly new to YouTube. Um, it's Paige from Paige Allen. Um, if you don't know who any of those are, I will link them all down below. Paige is a bit, like I said, she's newer, so she's got a bit of a smaller channel. So go and check her out. Let her know that I sent you if you do. Um, but yeah, they'll all be linked down below. But I hope you enjoyed this video. And any requests, as always, leave them down in the comments. And I'll try and get them done for you. But I don't think I have anything else to say except thanks for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys! <laughs>